guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Just Cake for Dancing Avon Lady, and today I'm sharing with you a pretty crazy haul that I got from Walmart. Um, all grocery related or kind of like personal care. Yeah, it was kind of crazy. I went to Walmart just to, like always, pick up a bag of milk, um, some toothpaste, eye drops, and some yogurt for Ginevra, and maybe some snacks if I found some good deals, and I came back with all of this. So, needless to say, I got some great deals. We typically buy most of our groceries from Walmart just because they do allow me to price match using the app Flip. Um, and they don't really limit me to which stores I can or cannot use. And I know like some Walmarts only allow you to use like, you know, price match with certain other grocers, but not all. So you're gonna hear some excessive noise because this is supper time right now. Nelson's going to be heating up the microwave. So if you hear beep, 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 and roar, it, it's the microwave or banging. And this says, and this says, oh. <laughs> say, oh. <laughs> yeah, we, we're in a new schedule. We're on a new schedule right now because it's school time. And so we are multitasking in this family, but I really want to share this haul with you before I had to put everything away. I really only paid full price for, I think, three of the items. Um, I did, I paid full price for the milk. I didn't, I couldn't find a good deal on milk this week, but I mean, on Walmart still, it's still under $5 for, you know, like, a, what's four liters of milk, so it's okay. Um, paid full price for the Colgate. I tried to find a deal and everywhere else was actually more expensive than Walmart, so, eh, like even their sale prices. So this was good. She picked this one up because it had Dora on it. Hopefully she'll like it. But she did not like the other one that I got her. She just complained every single time. She's like, I don't want my other toothpaste. Um, and then the other thing that I picked up that was full price are the Tears Natural. It's the uh, comforting relief for dry, irritated eyes. It's apparently supposed to have less preservatives in it. Um, because I do have, I tend to have like really dry, irritated eyes, and it actually affects my vision sometimes. So this is what my optometrist recommended, so I will try this out. I've tried off a couple of them already, and they don't work very well. So I'm happy with that. So this haul, um, it was mostly, like I say, for milk and then some, what do I want to get there? I want to get milk and toothpaste and some snacks. So. We have a tons of fresh fruits and vegetables, so don't think that we don't buy fruits and vegetables, but we already pre-got all of that stuff earlier last week and this week, so we only have, it's mostly like non-perishables with some milk and dairy. So, all right, let's start. So these are great, they're great for school. I actually bought four boxes of these because I freeze them. Um, they are regular around $2.47 at Walmart and they're having a, I guess either a price drop or just have promotion this week, $1.48, which is awesome, really good. Cause usually even when they go on sale, they're like $2 a box and it is a box of eight. And like I say, I freeze them and I put them in my lunch bag. She ate it today, so we're good. Cause we're just new to this whole packing lunch and snacks routine. So that was fun. So the next thing I got were these Sunripe uh, fruits plus vegetable drinks. Ginevra actually really likes these and they do have uh, some uh, like two servings of fruits and vegetables per cup in it. I usually, I dilute it because I don't give her full strength juice and she's willing to drink it and so it has no sugar added which is another thing I like. The regular I think like $3.47 at Walmart um, and we got them for $2. I was able to price match them for $2 so I was happy with that. A next regular price, well not regular price but the next thing that I got that was not a price match were these bear paws. I got them because the school only allows nut free and it has to have the nut free sign on it. So I got these because it is says nut free. She hasn't tried these before. She usually she usually gets um, like goldfish snacks. Oh my gosh, my nose is so itchy. It's like prime ragweed season right now. Uh, it's And so I figured we can give these a try. They were also, I think they're like also again, like right around the 350 mark. And I got them for $1.88. Next thing on the list, Almond milk. I missed almond milk. I ran out of almond milk and I've been drinking her uh, regular cow's milk for the last week just because I've been so insanely busy. I haven't had time to get to the store. Um, and so I'm so happy I was able to get this. I was able to price match this. Momer had it on two for seven dollars, but I was able to price match it down to two ninety two sorry, two for seven dollars. So it makes them three fifty each, but I only got one. Um 
because I was able to price match it for $2.99 and I know I can get a better price, but I just needed my almond milk. I love almond milk in my tea in the morning. The almond milk is not inside. No, it's for mommy. And this is the vanilla unsweetened one and it tastes amazing in my tea. tea. Vanilla kind of gives it the illusion that it's sweetened mommy, without the extra sugar. Yes, this is definitely vlog style because you hear everything else that's going on in my life right now. Other things I got, regular Walmart price for the Mott uh, Fruitations unsweetened apple sauces. These are great for school. She's been eating these since she was, I want to say little, but she's still little. But she told me today that, Mommy, I'm no longer a baby. I'm a big girl. I go to school. Yes. So, <laughs> anyways, I got her strawberry. I got a couple different flavors. I got her a strawberry kiwi one, two strawberry kiwi ones, a raspberry one and a peach, apple, and carrot. For some reason, she's recently fallen in love with carrots, so carrots in her applesauce too. Hey, why not? Garlic was a good deal too. Um, they're, I think they're like a regular $1.19 or $1.20, and I got these for 48 cents. I was able to price match these for 48 cents. Now, the next thing I got was a pack of 18 large eggs. These were going for like almost $5, and I got them down to $2.88, which makes them about 16 cents per egg. That's pretty good. But what like, about five eggs? Yeah, you want to eat five eggs? That's too many eggs. Bananas. I have not been able to price match bananas in forever. Like nothing was ever cheaper than Walmart until this week, which is awesome. So the regular, uh, I think at Walmart they're like 56 cents a pound, uh, yeah, 56 cents a pound, and I got them down to, do, 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 I think it was like 48 cents or 49 cents, which is really good. Like I, ha like I said, I haven't been able to price match bananas in a really long time, and the other thing I haven't been able to price match in a really long time are water chestnuts. These are awesome. I, I love using water chestnuts in my stir fry. These ones are already cut up. Um, they're sliced and peeled, so I don't know if you've ever tried to peel chestnuts by hand. It is labor intensive, like super labor intensive. So I love these. They're so fast, so easy. You just open up the can. I rinse them out, and then I just throw them in my stir fry. Or if I'm making like Chinese type uh, meatloaf, um, and I'll actually show you guys how to make that sometime. This is really, really simple. But Chinese style meatloaf, I will actually throw some of these in. I just chop them up even smaller. Or if I'm doing like an Asian inspired burger that Nelson will grow on their barbecue, I will put some of that into the beef patty. And it is delicious because that little bit of texture, the crunch is like, oh, so good. Super yummy. Oh, and Walmart was having these for 99 cents, which is actually a really good price already because lately I've only been seeing them for between a dollar twenty nine to about two dollars a can. However, I was able to price match what these this week for sixty eight cents. Next on the list are onions, and yes, I promise I will get back into doing the Jesse versus Onion series. I will have another episode up soon. I just haven't had time because I've been rushing dinner, and so I've just been going crazy, like just trying to prep dinner super fast, just because we've been so busy since like. What, beginning of of summer really it's just been non-stop go, go go so these regular price at walmart are around a dollar 47 to dollar 67 um this week though i got them for a dollar which is decent i've seen them cheaper before like sometimes they go down to 99 cents sometimes in a long time ago i've seen 88 cents but a dollar i'm still quite happy with these now, next, these were good too. These are regular about $4 each. So this is the laughing cow. Oh yes, these are Ginevra's. She promised me she would eat these and she made other people laugh at the store because she said, mommy, I promise I will eat these if you buy them. <laughs> yeah, so we will see. I'll pack one for her lunch tomorrow and see whether or not she eats it. Um, but these are regular around $4 at Walmart and I got a really good deal on these because these went down to $1.88 by price matching, which is quite decent. This is the smallest package, so there are eight portions, um, but still $1.88 for eight portions, that's, that's decent. Now for the big scores. So one of the big, super big scores that I got during this haul were the Campbell's Soup. 
Yes, I know it's canned. I know it's processed, obviously. However, if I'm ever in a pinch and I need something super fast, this stuff is amazing to cook with. I bought the cream of broccoli, cream of potato, cream of chicken, and the tomato with roasted red peppers is awesome. Like, cooking with Campbell's, hashtag, <laughs> is amazingly fast and simple. And when I am in a crazy rush and I just need something super fast, this is like super, super fast and it's so full of flavor. I usually either get low fat or low sodium and then I'll use like a can of low fat and a can of low sodium if I'm doing something saucy. Um, and we have made some like crazy comfort food recipes, like also Asian inspired and non-Asian inspired recipes by using like these uh, Campbell's. So these ones, because they are the specialty ones, they usually, I've seen them as much as $2.50 per can and I was able to get these for 44 cents a can so yeah I stocked up 44 cents a can and the even the lady the cashier was like yeah it's a good good deal I don't know where to put this one next amazing deal I got were Dove deodorants I really like these because I also find them really moisturizing and they don't leave a mark um, and usually they smell quite good they don't have the, the the peach one that I really liked on sale so these are regular almost six dollars I think it was like five dollars and 97 cents and I got the price match down to three dollars and then on checkout 51 when you buy two you get another three dollars off so essentially from six dollars I got these down to a dollar fifty each which is pretty amazing that's a pretty amazing deal that's like I'm only paying like 25 25 percent of the price that's a 75 percent savings like Oh my god, that's awesome. Awesome, and this will last me like a year <laughs> or more. <laughs> now, the biggest savings that I got, this. Kleenex wet wipes. I actually made a penny on this. Yay, because um, it's regular $5.47 on Walmart. I got a price match to $2.99, and then on another online uh, phone app, all right, they're, you're giving me back $3 for this. So essentially, I made a penny to take this out of the store. What are some of your favorite grocery saving tips? I mean, I am a lover of price matching. I love to price match. Like, not, unless it's a, a crazy necessity, if I can't get it on a price match price, I won't buy it because, I mean, why pay whole, full price when I can get it at a good discount? So I probably, all in all, saved on average about almost 50% of my grocery bill this time. Yeah. I mean, if it wasn't for this, because this was the most expensive thing on uh, in this, uh, during this grocery trip, this my the smallest item was the most expensive item, which is normal, right? Like diamond rings, right? Um, I probably would have saved even more. So this was a really, really amazing, amazing haul. I'm like super happy with it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you enjoyed this video, please do give me a big fat thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, please consider clicking that subscribe button below and that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I try to post between two to three videos a week. And if I do have time, I post up a fourth bonus video. Have an amazing night. Love you guys. Bye.